everybody! It's Brooke. We're back for episode three of season two of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I'm doing two of these a week. If for some reason this is your favorite episode and the first one you tuned in on, we're doing all of them. Uh, if you want to see ahead or my full reactions, you could check those out on Patreon. Uh, you should see my patrons here. Say hi. Uh, I really enjoy and love the support because it make, really shows me that people really do want me to keep going, which is so awesome. The Buffy community has been so welcoming. Um, I'm loving season two so far. Last episode was crazy with the twists and turns and the zombies. It felt almost like like a crime version of Buffy where they had to like stop these fucking crazy predators uh and it was like a guy whose brother died and he had brought him back to life but then he made friends with like this weird serial killer kid and um or future serial killer kid and his brother who he brought back to life wanted him to make him a girlfriend but they needed a head and they were gonna kill Cordelia to get it of course, Buffy saved the day because she is our queen. Uh, Willow helped because she is also awesome. And Xander was there. He did help, but his attitude still kind of annoys me. Uh, and overall, they did save the day. It was definitely a very complicated situation and topic. But at the end of the day, it was pretty clear that everyone on the bringing dead people back to life side were wrong. <laughs> uh, and not in the vampire way, by the way. It was more of a zombie kind of thing uh Buffy and Angel I couldn't tell if they like at the end they were kind of like you know talking about how it's hard for them with the like he's a vampire she's a human and the age difference there that I am choosing to ignore how inappropriate because it is a vampire show we can suspend our disbelief it's not real it is okay um but and then Xander and Willow have been getting closer. It feels like that sometimes. And then it feels like Xander's back to ignoring that she has feelings for him. And it's part of the thing that really annoys me about him. I want her to meet someone new who just likes her and doesn't see her as the person to hang out with when, like, Buffy's not interested. Which she's not interested. Ever. <laughs> uh, and then Cordy's really become part of the gang. And everyone else is kind of, like, funny jokey with her. But sometimes Xander's just mean. But, like, that is kind of their thing. But I think I like Cordelia too much. So I'm like, fuck off, Xander. <laughs> you know? But I'm excited to see. It does seem we're getting similar to last season. We're getting, like, a plot episode. Then a few, like, Monster of the Week episodes. But Angel is more mixed in. Because, like, last season he would kind of only show up on the episodes that were about vampires. And we didn't see him much on the non-vampire episodes, but he did help out uh, this last episode. Uh, he's in the opening, but he was before, but I think he might be more of a main character this season. Like, we might see him in all the episodes instead of just, like, some. Which is nice, because I do like his character. It can still be hard for me, because I'm still like, it's Baby Booth from Bones. <laughs> but I really, I do like his character, so I'm glad we're seeing more of him. Uh, and I'm, I'm just liking seeing everyone a bit more, except maybe one person, but you know, it's fine. Uh, <laughs> let us dive into episode three. I don't know what it's going to be about, but I'm just, I'm ready to watch it. I'm watching three and four now, so I can get ahead even more for my Patreon friends. Anyway, let's do this. He really shouldn't be a principal. Who do you think is the most troublesome student in this school? Me. Well, what? She hasn't student. even burned down a gym on here. Hand, he hasn't stabbed a horticulture teacher with a trowel. No stabbing, stabbing teachers. Sheila has never burnt down a school building. Well, that was never proven. The fire marshal said. Also, she never burned down a school building here. Let it go. It could have been mice. Mice. Oh wait. Oh, did they count the old science lab from last episode as her burning it down? They don't have proof that was her. Mice that were smoking? What does the winner get? Expelled. Uh, Thursday, she can win. Is parent-teacher now. I'm sorry to put the two of you in charge of this event. 
You have three days to prepare that the does seem like a horrible idea. Transform the school lounge and may affect what I tell your parents when I meet them. Are we clear? I'm clear. My man does not through? give good vibes. If I was a parent, I'd be like, mm. Good. It's two more students. That's what my mom sees when she yeah, that seems like a bad idea. Well, she looks definitely intense. She was already smoking in fifth grade. Once I was lookout for Yeah, she probably has a really bad oh, home life. It's not fair. As long as nothing really bad happens between now and then, you'll be fine. Are you crazy? What did you say to happen? when something bad is gonna happen? Yeah, he did kind of curse her. Also, so what is he wearing? Maybe this time it'll be different. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's not gonna be different. I mean, the man is wearing a duster. Or woman. I haven't seen yet. What is that hair, bro? <laughs> they were full, like, epic character, new vampire, and he got the ramen hair. <laughs> home sweet home. He feels like a bigger than a one-off, though. If I was the Buffy, though, I wouldn't trust a Someone single human I met place. at nighttime. As long as the Slayer is alive, whoever takes his place will be sharing his grave. Can you do it? Yes. I might go with no this cardigan wearing ass. The night of Saint Vigian. You were there. You. Oh, it's Ramen Boy. I had a uh, throat this short king says no. I was actually at Woodstock. That was a weird gig. <gasps> oh, get punched. So. Maybe this is our new bad guy. Who are you? Spike. That's a name. That Wait a second. My friend Tanya, I was talking to you guys about this in the other episodes. Her favorite character is introduced this season. And one of her cat's names is Spike. That could be a coincidence, but I'm thinking it's not. Tanya and her loving of bad guys. I tell you, I knew it was going to be a bad guy. He's going to have some, like, anti-hero shit going on. I know her. Good guy. Problems. I'm, I'm going to make fun of her for his hair. Do you know what I find works real good with Slayers? Killing them. Guys, I'm going to text her and be like, is it Spike with the ramen hair? And she's at work, so I don't know if she'll get back to me. Who am I kidding? Who the fuck is that? Drusilla, weak. Look at all the people. Are these nice people? We're getting along. She looks like a lovely white lady. <laughs> <laughs> Who is she? Has power. But anointed and all that. Do you like daisies? Oh, she's scarier than him. I plant them, but they always die. Oh, okay. Spike. She's the first person to really be freaking me out. Uh, okay, maybe she's the new villain and he's the henchman. I'll do your slayer for you. But you keep your flunkies. Yeah, I don't think so, bro. She's gonna take your Dude. Justin Timberlake ass down. Kill a spike. Kill it for me. It's done. Girl be wacko. Princess. How about this slayer? They're all like, what are we watching? Which included a reminder notice about parent-teacher night. Uh-oh. Thursday. That's good. Oh, uh, he's gonna oh, ruin her parent-teacher night, and she's gonna get in weeks. trouble. Uh-huh. So. I mean, he also might kill her, but I doubt that. She'll be fine. Look, sweetheart. Life is more than grades and homework and not getting kicked out of school. What I don't want is to be disappointed in you again. Oh, okay, Mom. That's, like, well, the last thing that really I too. harsh. Like, Poor Buffy. Like, that's part of why I think her mom should just, like, know. We're going to the bronze tonight. Because of how you thought Angel might show. If he does, he'll meet some other nice girl. Studying comes first. We're going to the bronze. He's such a little dork. Oh, Rupert, no. They're doing their weird old people flirting. Very funny. What's the up, guys? Didn't make balloon animals. Uh, he led a crusade of, of uh, vampires. They swept through Hadessa, Haram, and points east. <laughs> what happens when you let your life interfere with your slave? Okay, well, if my slave... Okay, well, she can't spell, get kicked out of school. Won't get me killed, okay? Well, we'll help. Yeah, I'll whittle stakes. I love Willow's and necklace. So Scooby-Doo shirt. Sure. Must have been owned by the same company. You wouldn't be helping Buffy and Sheila's place, would you? <laughs> no. We're hindering. Oh. 
I feel bad for Sheila, but I don't think I would have covered for her. I know you wanted everything to be perfect, but let's just go with what we have. No problem. Maybe she'll owe her one. Did you really burn down a school building one time? Not actually one time. Cool. Dude. It's Angel message. Well, I didn't say for sure. It was a maybe see you there kind of deal. No wonder my brain's fried. No, Come you on. guys need this. Oh no, it's Ramen Boy. Okay, there's two. He tries to kill her and she kicks his ass, or he falls in love with her too. Sorry, he's staring at her like Angel used to stare at her. Go get something to eat. Where's the phone? I need to call the police. There's some big guy out there trying to bite someone. I hate you. Also, that guy didn't react to that at all. Get off of her. She's just trying to have a fun day. Okay, he's strong, but we got this. Why doesn't she not have them on her at all times? She used to. Oh, it's in her bag. Okay, it's a tampon. Chill out. Fuck off, bro. She's like, I have a spike. I'm like, who the fuck? You find out on Saturday. I kill you. She's like, not if I kill you first. This is why we need the mini crossbow in the sleep. What? Are they van? Uh, Where'd what? How high is she right now? Not funny. Oh, not him. Not Who good. Are you? What happened to him? Why does he they care about sleep. her? Uh, hey. honey, have Wait some up. like she has no What's sense of dangerous situations. Well, whoever he is, we'll need all the help we can get come this Saturday. So this night of St. Vigius deal. Could we hide? <laughs> Running is cowardly. Is hiding is strategic. Well, can't be any worse than any other creature you face. Once he starts something, he Late. doesn't stop. Until oh. we were at the bronze before. Thought you said you might show. You She's like, sorry, yeah, something crazy just happened, but also you didn't show up for our maybe kind of not a date. Wow, two centuries of dating. If you only had two a year, that's still like 400 dates with 400 different... Gag them a bit. For sure. Good point, Why Willow. Why call it a mace? <laughs> uh, um... Urgent ma okay, that's it. I'm oh, she responded, you guys. Do you want to? Do you want to hear her response? I said, "There's a character named Spike with ramen hair. It's him, isn't it?" And she said, "I have no clue what you're talking about. I'm totally not that predictable." LOL. <laughs> uh, I think we found it. So he must be a pretty like he must at least continue for this season. With a little bell on that guy. She's a bad example. She's terrifying, yeah, by the way. Today. I'm not that scared of ramen boy. Darling, but her, she freaks me out. This is the she a vampire? Because she doesn't Hell seem as like... You, put color in your cheeks. <laughs> Why do all her dolls have their mouths tied over? Oh my True. god, leave her alone. He trust you. I'll go up and get chanty with the fellas, but you got to do me one favor. Leave that poor girl alone. Eight. No, she is. She is a vampire. See, we need mini ones that everyone can carry around in their back pocket. That's a big knife. <laughs> Not her cutting the vegetables. I mean, if this guy Spike is as mean as you all said, it should be over pretty quickly. We're still all rooting for you on Saturday. I'd be there for you myself if I didn't have a leg wax. <laughs> you guys hold down the fort. My queen. I do see these two ending up together, and I don't think I'd hate it. No. Well, I did one pepper! I made it fresh and everything. How much sugar did you use? No, I like red, too. Sugar? Sorry. She didn't make lemonade without it's sugar. Very good. Um, here, have some lemonade. Don't drink, don't, don't drink right it. Right after Willow shows you the library. Is that your mother? Here. So, oh, what if... Oh, sorry. Um, Girl, yeah, we pour over yeah, the punch bowl. I was you, but, um... She wouldn't have said much. She Child has us locked up in that library working on your weapons. Even slaves get minimum wage. No, they don't. But 
Is that your mom? Now that is a woman that knows how to moisturize. Did it like skip a generation? <laughs> But you haven't seen the boiler room yet, and you know that's really interesting. What with the yeah, a girl got like brain down there once. Principal Snyder, I'm afraid we need to talk. She I mean, you put on a job. yeah. When she did great. Tenth high school reunion. You'll still be grounded. Cordelia, yeah. have some lemonade. It's <laughs> known as William the Bloody, and his nickname that's by not torching great. his victims with railroad spikes. Ew, freak! Oh, here's some good news. He's... I think your suggestion of running away this Saturday might have been a good one. Oh no, what Spike is it? Spike fought two slayers in the last century, and he's killed them both. Uh, okay, so we need a blockade. Wait, bro, people are still, like, there. What the fuck? Oh, is your mom gonna find out? Mike. Yeah, you said she had till Saturday, jerk. Ah. Again, they still haven't learned how to dodge in this show. Ugh, thank God the vampires like lose that ability. No thanks. Slayer. She either went that way or that way. I saw two others. You're too old to meet. I hated that. Ew! I'm judging my friend next time we talk. <laughs> he probably goes through character development, but I'm like, ew! But not to kill. A couple of fans. Who are you gonna fucking call anyway? Find Angel. He knows about Spike. We need him. No, I'm not going anywhere until I know that Buffy and Willow are all right. To know what we'll be all okay, right. Okay, so they'll die help. if you don't get help, bro. But is there something wrong with their faces? Yes. Yes. PCP. It's a gang. Yes. On PCP. It's PCB. He's correct. Look, I know okay, she has things, to tell her mom after serious. this. You can't go out. Don't worry Good thing these vampires don't have as much super yeah. strength as the old ones. But maybe they're weaker without the master being alive. Uh, uh, no, thank you. Listen, I am the watcher. I am responsible for her, and I, I have to go. We have to get her the weapon. Be careful. What if she comes looking well, for the weapon down. here, and he took it out in the hall? Yeah, she got this. She's like, yeah, I went through the How ceiling. It was a whole thing. Principal Snyder, my mother and four others are locked in the science room across the hall. Okay, I'm gonna take the vamps out in the hall. After that, you get my mom and the others out the same way. Let me help you. Giles, my mother's in that room. She needs you to I get her out of here. I know you'll make sure she does. Set him up. Yeah, that's kind of on them for splitting up like that. She's going full Assassin's Creed on these vampires, dude. You're gonna die out there. You heard what Buffy said. She's a stupid Good. I hope he does die, and they can get a new principal who doesn't suck. Oh, there was literally an axe right there, bro. Yeah, what did you think was gonna happen? You know a lot about the spike guys, so um you got a plan? <laughs> Good plan. I suck. I'm beefing with Han, you know. Wait, can we get rid of him? Got the door. I'm almost dead. Woo! The, the other vampire didn't here. hear that? Just hang on for one more minute until I tell you to open the door. Sheila, where have you been? Sorry, I'm late. There's some really Oh weird guys my outside. god, he turned her into Shh. a vampire. Oh, Spider. are they friends? <laughs> Spike. <laughs> well, he's obviously faking it, but. Friends? I taught you to always guard your perimeter. What's new with you? Everything. Yeah. Come up against this slayer yet? Gave the puppy dog a mall tortured ass. Keeps her off my back when I feed. <laughs> Tricking him, right? Because that will break my heart. Undead liar guy. Yeah, she's definitely a vampire now. Oh my god! Bubby, turn around! Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> Bitch! You're like a baby. You do not want to fight her. Get them out! You're coming too! In a minute, go! Why so scared of the Slayer? Scared? Yeah. 
time was, you would have taken her out in a heartbeat. Now look at you. You know? Uh, this, uh, I'm just like relaxing. Out, We're all friends. We'll do it together. Right. To I don't think he believes him either. Yeah, you didn't believe that. You were my sire, man. You were my Yoda. Oh. Exchange. Not up. Dude, Come he on, turned people. ramen boy? This isn't a spectator sport. I smell the blood of a nice, ripe girl. Vampires are very easy to goad with their, like, the last confidence and stuff. You shouldn't have come here. Yeah, no. this is their I school. Up your doilies and stuff. As a personal favor, from me to you, I'll make it quick. It won't hurt a bit. No, Spike. It's gonna hurt a lot. Kick his butt! Does she have another steak? Oh my god, no, no, do not go back. Sander and Angel back to be a crime fighting duo. Stunt man with completely different hair. Get smacked. Dude, did her mom save her? I'm scared she's gonna die. Bro, I don't think what's her face would like you talking about women that way. I don't like him. We disagree. He is a good villain, though. He is entertaining. Well, another wonderful, fun-filled evening. We'll be friends forever. You decided to start avoiding me. So when you gave him my neck to chew on, why didn't you clock him before he had a chance to clock you? I told you. I couldn't make the first move. I had to see if he was buying it or not. With you being Spike Sire. What's a sire? Okay, come on, Xander. It means he turned him into a vampire. Do you want the usual story? Gang-related, PCP? But you have in mind the truth. Right. Gang-related, PCP. So a bunch of the police and everyone in Sunnydale so, knows something weird is going on? Principal Snyder talk about anyway? I have a daughter who can take care of herself. Who's brave and resourceful and thinks of others in a crisis. Yeah, she might not be the best at school, but she's like a good person who cares. I'm so glad her mom's okay. I thought she was gonna die. Oh, give her like two days. I'll never be mean to anyone. They're still in the closet! If it's that time of the month. And can you please send some as hey? They didn't hear, like, the police doing a sweep through the school? Slayer with family and friends. That sure as hell wasn't in the brochure. Oh, okay. most of them must be on their own. I have a nice celebration. How's the annoying one? He doesn't want to play. <laughs> yeah, he don't like your vibe. Well, suppose I better go make nice. You failed. I, um... I okay, kid, I don't see you Thanks. trying, though. I was rash. Wait, wasn't he the one who didn't want to go? And they all wanted to go? Exactly the same. Only I do. I feel like this. yeah, he's gonna kill that kid. I mean, when the bad guys fight, I'm kinda like, eh. He just killed the anointed one? I thought that was gonna be a big deal. I mean, he does seem like a more fun villain. But also, I thought that was gonna be a much bigger thing. I'm judging so hard. <laughs> no, oh my god, that one was also, so it seemed like we got plot, monster of the week. This seemed like a heavy plot, vampire plot episode. I can't believe the anointed one was dead. I thought he was going to be the big bad of this season. She was going to have to fight like a child. <laughs> I guess that makes more sense to put her up against someone who's not a child. Um, I don't think I'll get over the hair anytime soon. But he is a way better villain. Like, he's his acting's a lot better and he's a lot more compelling. I'm, like, very into this. Him and the girl that's with him. He called her Drew. I'm really into them as a pair. Uh, like, villains, they, like, both... Are really good. She creeps me out. Her actress is insane. She really gives creep vibes. Um, so I think they're a cool pair of villains for this season. I think they're obviously not one-offs and they're gonna be coming back. Um, it's interesting to know that Angel made Spike 
I don't know if it's, like, true blood, where the person who made you kind of has control of you uh, until they, like, release you or something, because he didn't seem to have control over Spike's decisions. Uh, but Spike, at the same time, seemed, like, excited to see him till he realized he was definitely faking it. I don't know if he knew that whole time or not. Um, I loved... Cordelia and Willow hiding in the broom closet was, like, such a good reoccurring thing to bring some levity each time, I feel like. Uh, we got Xander and Angel being their crime-fighting duo again. I like Xander when they interact. Like, I feel like they bounce off each other well. Uh, I did not expect... I guess I should have expected them to come and, like, destroy the parent-teacher night, but he says Saturday, so I was like, oh, she'll see him tomorrow. Uh, but I really like that. I guess her mom bought the PCP thing? Because the principals and the cops seem to know about vampires. Unsurprising that they lied about it. Um, so, like, bigger people in Sunnydale must know about vampires and they just, like, brush it under the rug kind of thing. Uh, but her mom definitely, like, was relatively chill about her daughter, like, taking the lead in that situation. So I do wonder if she could tell her and it would be okay. Uh, I think it would be easier. Oh, sorry, if she knew would she didn't have to make up excuses for certain things, but who knows. Um, I'm trying to think if I missed any plot points of this. I feel bad for the girl who, like, obviously was going through it a lot and then got turned into a vampire. She didn't die, though. I forget her name. The girl who was in trouble with Buffy originally. She didn't die. She ran off. So, I wonder if we'll explore the sire, uh, made, like, vampire relationship through her and that Drew lady. So we can see more what that's like. Uh... Felix and Spike knew Angel pre, I guess, him becoming, having a soul. Maybe we'll get some more info on his life before everything happened. Um, I really liked the use of the school set in this one. Uh, again, the school will not be closed. They will have school the next day. <laughs> uh, because, you know, nothing shuts this school down. Sunnydale cares about education. Um, but overall, this was also a really good episode. I'm, like, a lot more into the main storyline this time of, like, I kind of was like, okay, the anointed one will just keep trying to kill her all season, but these two seem like they have something else planned. So I'm excited to see what that is. I'm excited to have a villain I'm excited to watch and, like, a hero I support and kind of see how that goes. Uh, yeah, but I really enjoyed this. Uh, I hope you guys did as well. I hope you like, subscribe, and leave me a comment uh, in the either comments or on Discord or on Patreon, wherever you want to chat. Either way, I can't wait for episode four, so I will see you next time.